Morgan Freeman has apologized after eight women came forward accusing the actor of sexual harassment, but this is not the first time he has found himself at the center of controversy. Back in 2009, the National Enquirer alleged Freeman was in a romantic relationship with his step granddaughter, Adina Hines. Three years later, reports emerged that the pair planned to marry, which both Freeman and Hines vehemently denied. The recent reports of any pending marriage or romantic relationship of me to anyone are defamatory fabrications from the tabloid media designed to sell papers. Freeman said denying the allegations in a statement in 2012. Hines echoed her step grandfather in her own statement saying, These stories about me and my grandfather are not only untrue, they are also hurtful to me and my family. Allegations of a romantic relationship between the pair re emerged during the murder trial for Hines. She was stabbed to death in 2015, aged 33, by her boyfriend at the time, Lamar Davenport. In the trial, Davenport's defense lawyers alleged Hines was in a romantic relationship with her step-grandfather. Since the latest allegations surrounding Freeman have come to light this week, a video has also resurfaced from a 2011 interview with the actor discussing his secret to attracting women also likening them to horses in a pasture. In it, the Shawshank Redemption star stressed he had permanent respect for women whilst chatting to Piers Morgan on his now axed CNN show Piers Morgan Live. Don't chase women, they'll chase you. Freeman told the presenter, adding that his strategy works very well. You meet a lady, you express to her how wonderful she looks, or how you respond to the way she looks and go on about your business, Freeman said. You walk into a pasture and the horse sees you, he's coming over to investigate, Freeman said.